Hi, this is Gary Fong, and I've got in this box here the contents of what was in our fireproof safe. Now, our fireproof safe actually did pretty well. I'll show you what was inside it. We had, um, you know, photos and negatives, and so here are the negatives. These guys made it. You can see right through that. Um, and this, this, by the way, this is just like, you know, this is acetate, right? Now, you can see there's a bunch of smoke around it, but it did make it. And what was really interesting was that the um, box itself was burned through. The hole was burned through. And some of the papers, like, you know, there's some photographs here that are kind of singed. So it did go through quite a bit of heat because some of these, well, actually, I think all of our video DVDs melted in the heat. So there was quite a bit of pretty intense heat inside there. And actually, every single one of these was pretty poorly melted. And so those are definitely not recoverable because the plastic's gone, so obviously the tape inside it's gone. But all of these uh, CDs, you see the condition there, and there's a lot of smoke and everything like that. But we put uh, one in the... Um, in the drive and completely readable, just as if nothing as if nothing had happened to it. So they're uh, covered with smoke, but you can see here that uh, this acetate actually survived. So then I thought, and then there was um, you know other paperwork in here. So you can see that there's papers, and the paper here has. Uh, you know, some burn marks on it. So it went through some pretty intense heat. But what was pretty cool is a lot of times people say, okay, well, hard drives. So the thing about hard drives is they always say that hard drives are very, very sensitive to heat and they won't survive. So they didn't have a lot of hope for this hard drive because as you can see here, it's singed. Um, the cords made it, but they're in pretty bad shape and the power supply made it, but as you can see from the drive, it, it was pretty messed up. So I plugged it in and booted it up, and as you can see right here, there it is. Uh, this was actually my wife's hard drive, and she had a lot of stuff in here that uh, she thought, you know, would be gone, and so went through the mourning process of knowing that, you know, all of this stuff was gone, and here it is. Uh, and we went through these files. The drive opens perfectly fine. You can click in any of these folders. You see some of these two, two megabytes uh, JPEGs that were taken in 2005, which is as large as you could probably get back then. And uh, the, the files all made it fine. So that's a pretty remarkable thing to think that the hard drive made it through the fire. And this is one thing that um, a lot of people say insure against is the heat. Of course you do that, but this just shows you proof that the uh, the drive can go through some pretty intense heat and still hold its data as well, uh, still hold its data as well the DVDs. Okay, so um, what I'm going to do at this point right now, just to not take any chances, is we're backing everything up to the 25 gig uh, archival 200 year Blu-ray DVDs because, you know, though this is working fine now, we don't know uh, when it will crash. So we're in the process right now of backing everything up so that we'll have it. And then once we back it up to the Blu-ray archival drives, it's going to go to our bank safe deposit where uh, I, I can't even think of how more to protect this, uh, these images. Okay, so that is a real true life case history of um, saving your data in a fire. Uh, someone on the uh, someone on one of the pages said, you know, have you tested the hard drives after intense heat? And now I can say that it wasn't a test. This was actually a real life situation, and the data survived. Okay, so thanks for watching. Make sure to uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and uh, we're going to have a premium video, uh, extended length video, to show you my uh, safe my data safe workflow for preserving your digital assets.